Hello Twitch, I'm back. One of one of these. I have done some grinding. Uh, in the past, yesterday. And found a couple problems with my approach just now. So um I'm going to have to be tricksy here. Turn off the audio settings for now for this for the main game cuz we get some cutscenes to watch. So let's get right to it. <laughs> I don't even have to press a button. I thought we met her before already. <laughs> But I guess not. Mm -hmm. da, 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 da. I really thought we had that discussion already with her. I guess I'm also re experiencing these cutscenes. Da, 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 da. I could clip these and have cutscenesception. Some nonsense like that. <laughs> They're pretty much gonna run nonstop. But, ooh, no, you can see in my mouse. Da 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 da. I'm not quite sure how much I am reacting to stuff here. Uh, okay, another cutscene. Um, right, we had a discussion with Plachter. Mm. About the way that I came in this world. Mm hmm. Basically, my theory is that it has something to do with there being essentially two versions of Plachter. There's her, that's her, and then there's our Plachter, which probably is the same, but also not. So at the same time, the same people got called twice. Is my guess there? Mm hmm So she probably called both platters. Is what I'm going with. 
Also, I got a feeling that my quality is a little bit worse. No. Uh, right. There's a total, there was a total of four cutscenes. I did kind of master my approach to this. Oh, well. Fine tune it. Uh, right. So, a lad found some weird shaped ore. I have to now think of those rocks of a special shape that you can buy and they are for a specific purpose not a purpose you should use them for I'm not gonna go further in and um that would be NSW the worst Jenneth Paltrow should tell you enough let's hope it doesn't come to that <laughs> yeah, some people would, I guess. Okay. The cut is a little bit weird if I'm thinking about it, and the quality is kind of sucky, if I'm being completely honest. <laughs> Sleeping on a job. That's what I call aspirational. <laughs> you know what? I should have freaking gotten more water before the stream. Eh, well, that's what you get for doing a semi spontaneous one. Mm. Yeah, honey, that only works until a certain point. And at that point, when you reach that point, yeah, they're never coming back. Thinking of social media. But then again, that's just her sleeping on a job and waiting for people to come in and then waking up. Which I'd say is just efficient. <laughs> So I guess she doesn't even drink a lot of doesn't need even need to drink a lot of milk. <laughs> Maybe it's a different version. It could also be a version from the future. <laughs> um I'm assuming we're soon gonna have Wait, do we? Have I unlocked the thing? I don't think so. Because the other service she gives us is the duplication thing, and it's so good. Mm. The most integral part. It's It was a pain in the air in the popo, and why am I trying not to swear? This is not YouTube. It was a pain in the ass that you didn't have it in Atelier Fierce. Uh, 
I mean, the game was still pretty neat. And I definitely tried to move the the character there. Okay, that's enough from of that. Or rather, that is all of that. So I'm going to close that. And we're going back to the game. Um, I found that a little bit loud. That, uh... Um... I also, the, with that, I experienced a little bit with, like, uh, application audio capture stuff. Because I was w watching other things, obviously, while just playing the game and running the recording. Because, obviously, that's... I mean, I'm not entertaining with this one. I'm just keeping track of potential cutscenes. Because I was always thinking, some of these things I could probably just do on my own. They're not very that much viewable, like doing a lot of grinding, grabbing more resources, going through all the recipes and that kind of stuff. But then you miss all these cute cutscenes and some of them are so adorable. Like, I do think that's one of the strengths of this game. How adorable the, these characters are. Look at her. Look at this kitty. I am pointing at her with my hand, which you can't see. I need some kind of hand asset. Ah, I love this game. I love these games. Go get him. They're still cheap for like a couple more days. I'd recommend starting with Sophie. Probably there's probably a package of the two games. Hmm. Fun fact, I did a little little test let's play that I never released, obviously, because that wasn't the point. Right before starting to stream. It was a good way to get rid of some of that anxiety. I was still overthinking it at that point. And just, you know, kind of... It was kind of nice. A little bit of voice training, too. Um... Okay, so there was a thing we were supposed to do that I didn't actually quite understood at the time. Um, by the way, I did do a little bit... Like, I obviously I crafted some stuff. Uh, you know, weapon, some equipment, just a little bit more. It's not really hard yet. And like, do you have later on some stuff that can be a lot harder? But that's really at the point where you end game. And then you get all the super duper items, which is fun too. But the point is, I learned some crafting. Nothing too exciting. The really exciting and OP stuff. That comes later. Mm. Mm. And immediately you get some stuff. Not really good stuff. We do need bugs. And you seem to get them this way for now. Uh, later on, somewhere along the line, I should be able to build a bug catching net. Gotta see whether that is already available or soon. Well, I have not crafted it. Oh, the game also introduced a new mechanic, which is gathering spots, like special gathering spots. Oof. Um, where you get some bonus stuff. Like it's it's kind of a roulette thing. No, not roulette. Um, spinny thingy. That spinny gambly thing. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, so you find something and then you gotta, well, then you gotta spin it and you get bonuses. It's kind of neat. And like, y the ingredients can get 
bonus stuff they can get you can get more of them all depending on how how good the thing is you have uh uh expired ticket huh i don't really know what that is but i guess in the end this is kind of a let's feel mm, and it's free so i shouldn't complain anyway there's some cool stuff here barely to understand what you said there i would have had to pay attention sorry okay Ooh, natural oil i don't think you were able to craft to like gather that in the old games was well, it always a bit of pain because natural oil tended to be one of these things that you needed for some of the chains because <clears throat> you know it's all about the chains um is this also natural oil oh i'll take natural oil any day mm. I do wonder whether you could, like, tackle some of these with different equipment. Like, everything else seems to be fairly automatic. Like, I have that, that plant gathering one. But that's pretty much you use that. <laughs> but I mean, they are better. Some of the things we have. Then just hitting it with a stick. Uh, anyway. So presumably there's some cutscene stuff here. Um. <clears> hmm. <throat> hmm. Right. No. Hmm. We were trying to get the recipe for these weather changing machines, stone thingies, that recharge of them anyway. Um mm, interesting. So that means we have the recipe. Oh that's pretty good. Okay, let's go back. Mm -hmm. We get some stuff. That's good. Sunlight Heliodor. Good, good, good. God, her outfit. Look at it. It has so so many cool details. Mm -hmm. Is that her hair? That's like weaved into this thing and with belts and it needs ah oh, it's so good i love this game um <laughs> let's make a quick one of these we're gonna make better ones later and there are gonna be lots of things to make there <clears throat> and lots of ways to make it Slightly better, too. Uh, it's just can't have everything here. Mm -hmm. MP consumption down is gonna be really useful, because if you can get a if you can get a twenty down to a ten, then you then it's free of the of the group thing, which that's so good. I've also taken took several screenshots of that scene later, just a second ago. It's pretty good for like. I hope it's gonna be pretty good for cats. Uh, for thumbnails. Mm, I'll see how that goes. Mm, yep. Just out to put everything in. It's fine. Mm, 
Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's always good when you have ingredients that have lots of things. I love it. Mm, that's already pretty good. Um, I should probably look up what some of these things even mean. Mm, um, we're gonna just put auto ingredients in. That's entirely fine, I think. Okay, so that looks good. Um, right, I was thinking about whether we can get some high quality settle. Ooh, that's go it's gonna be hard to do when we don't at least have something that gives us increased quality. Hey, Bez! Yeah, I got myself another Atelier game. These are nice. I've also kind of... Just before that, I done, like... I presented some cutscenes that I recorded while playing this game off-screen. Seriously, is if you don't have the plugin InfoWriter, it's really good for making like highlights. It basically just creates a log file. So you give it a hotkey, it creates a log file while you stream or record, and you press the hotkey and it records a timestamp, which you can then just go back and look at the the position and say, hey, that's a good well, that could be a thingy. Um, fun fact: Atelier games were an Atelier game was the first game I played on stream. Um, hmm. it's a little bit of a thing. Like, how do I make it so this is good to watch, as it always is? Um, oh, that's a 50 quality plus. Right now, I am mostly thinking about the quality of my, of the thing I'm making. So these are pretty cute. Like it's, these are pretty cute games. Really nice characters. They have just such vibrant worlds. They have such amazing costumes. Costume design. And it's all about, well, some kind of crafting mechanic. There's usually, like, some series. These are divided in series of games. So this is the mysterious book series. And... Yeah. Um... What was I going to do? Probably some kind of quality. If I can get a quality and then quality plus plus, that gives me another quality. Which is more quality. Um, Let's sort this by quality. Because I'm supposed to make a settle that has quality 70. Hmm... That's going to be tricky. But I have lots of green. Um, um, so with these games, they have a mechanic where you have to align these... these stars and that unlocks on the left side on the right side the things the the maximum of things mm. okay so it's the atelier series this one is atelier sophie atelier sophie 2 the fourth the thing 
Um, the full game is Atelier Sophie 2, The Alchemist of the Mysterious Dream. Thankfully, I could just look at my own bot who tweeted out the, the title of the game. So, the Atelier series is the... Which is on sale right now. Which is why I got Atelier Sophie 2. Was a good opportunity. I seriously love these games. They are so... So chill. My great. Uh, I don't think I have completely understood the the kind of mechanics in this game yet. Hmm. Uh, like in this one, you get some kind of bonus by filling up a whole line but i'm not quite sure how that works mm. um anyway we have something to give so like how you make money in this one is well i mean you can sell things but the main way is through these kind of missions, commission things. And this one wanted a settle with a quality of 70. <sighs> so that's nice. Um, anything else? Mm hmm. Uh, we're gonna make one at some point. Um, I'm not quite sure about these big ones, these big enemies. Mm. Um, can always make another craft. Um, you know what? Maybe we will make, we will tackle one of these big enemies. Hmm. Why not? If we don't succeed, that's content. <laughs> uh, I don't like the word content, obviously. It's the home organization of producing things, but... um, Let's make some stuff. So first we can just make a craft which is basically just some kind of bomb. Um for these kind of things and like just kinda getting for that stuff, getting to make the things first. It has a nice function where you just auto put the stuff in. Really comfortable. Um, so that's one request. Um, interesting. Sunlight Heliodor. Ah, I see how this one works. You craft one of them and then you craft them again and recharge them that way. Pretty neat. Um... I don't think any of these traits do anything here. And really, I would want a lot of red. So let's see how many rats we got. Um, um, understandably, water tends to be blue, but not always. No wait, that's those are gases, huh? Um so definitely best to do it myself here. Not quite sure how many I can get to begin with. Mm-hmm. 
So basically how this works is each color gives you a well each color gives you one plip on the right and the stars get rid of uh we connect them they get rid of one of these gray things which obviously you want um and these special symbols they give you two they give you an extra one i mean uh oh Would have been nice to get another one here, but alas, ooh, uses plus three, that's not bad. Um, <clears throat> da, da, da. Okay, and that's that. Seriously, look at this sc these screens. Such cute character art. I'm definitely gonna use some of those as like something else. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah, it is pretty confusing. Then again, this is the fourth title, and I've already done the tutorials that explains you how it works, and have not, and also have not quite understood how everything works. These are not the only mechanics that will come. Mm. They tend to throw a lot at you. Hmm. 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 Once you get the hang of it, I don't find it particularly hard, but that is as someone who played these games of quite some time. Mm -hmm. If you want to try a game, I definitely recommend Atelier Sophie the first one. Like it's charming, it doesn't have a time limit. And it's pretty chill about stuff. Mm. At least... No. At least that's where I started. That is Atelier Sophie. Not Atelier Sophie 2. Mm -hmm. I think it's a good general rule of thumb that you shouldn't start with the fourth series uh, the fourth title in a series riser could also be a good start i'm not quite sure about that game like i have not watched too much about it till now <laughs> and by the way the girl in the front right now is plachta who is the past version of our Plachter, who is in fact, who was in the first game, first a book. Turns out she was also prior, prior a girl. And we turned her back into a girl. Doll version. And like, let's be honest, it's pretty gay. Even if it's like, it's the, the, you know. What's the word again? I forgot it. The thing that only cowards do. Subtext. It's a little subtexty, but it's also very harder family, more than family. It's pretty cute. Anyway, we're searching for our Plachter, which is basically the plot of where this is going. Uh, if things are confusing, it's also partly because I'm not good at explaining things. When I have to think of like three different things that you have to explain which would be easy if you don't like get confused and i should not be talking over cutscenes even if they are like just text to read mm. um, mm. 
Anyway, these games are adorable. They can be a little bit on the grindy side. Ooh, that too can be an appeal. Yeah, essentially. Also, to be fair, there's a good amount of boys too. Lots of interesting, cute characters, I'd say. Definitely lots of cute girls. <laughs> also, the crafting is very involved and I love it. And one of the fun things for me is to like the... To, to get to the process of taking these different components and then putting them through a line of stuff to put them where you actually want them. If that makes sense. It's probably easier to like kind of just show in a crafting scene. But I should pay attention to the cutscenes. Mm. <laughs> See? This this is the kind of subtexty thing. Ah. Mm. If you remember that the the kind of bl the blonde girl on the right is essentially past version of a wife. <laughs> also, I'm not quite sure whether we are now younger or older than this plachter, but I don't think that really matters. <laughs> Uh, Plachta Synthesis. Ooh. Interesting. No, I want to know this. Uh, I may now synthesize items of Plachta as well as of Sufi. Hmm, you can choose which alchemist to synthesize with when interacting with the cauldron. Hmm. Interesting. So, first of all, as you can see, Plachta is level 25 in terms of alchemy level. I'm assuming she actually is level 25, while we are level 50, which makes sense because we had at least a whole game of playing, doing this stuff. So, hmm. Okay, so basically, you gotta work with both of them. <laughs> and you might not be able to do some of them with Plachter. <laughs> and exclusive recipes, huh? <clears throat> Ah, so that's also a cool. I, I, I love these mechanics. Uh, uh, I could gush about these games for hours. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so we have exclusive stuff. So we have reasons to only work to work with Plachta or to work with Sophie. Gotcha. <laughs> okay, sorry, got a little burpy there. Uh, if you're having trouble unlocking the recipe so I can next to them. Okay. Mm -hmm. That I find a little bit easier to understand. It was not always easy to understand, like, what actually 
what kind of things are essentially things that you will unlock through story um that's all nice and good but i'm gonna take a break because you know you gotta take a break reasons uh so see you in a bit Da, da, da. Okay. Mm. Break time's over. Da, 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 da. And yes, hydration is important. Um. Okay. So now, I guess what we need to do is create stuff with. Our good friend, Plachta. Well, future wife. Um, so I guess we also need to make them each one here, a new. Um, let's start with the stuff we actually need and then you can focus on other things. Um, <laughs> we can always make them better later. Uh, I'm just gonna auto add them because I am not 100% sure what I will need in the next one. And honestly, did a pretty good job. Mm <laughs> hmm. Da 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 da. Mm -hmm. Um. Ooh, she did not look happy with it, but it's fine. Um, I do want the fishing rod. Um. Uh, no. Let's just see. Okay, these are all essentially the same. This one, okay, maybe I should have focused more on the fishing, uh, on the stuff. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. major gathering level one. Ah, this is gonna be complicated. Mm -hmm. 
But there are a couple of things that might make our life a lot easier. Or they probably will. Um, hmm. So we don't have a lot of rats, so that's almost definitely a bit of a filler. Uh, blue is pretty much useless for us. Uh, and the main thing seems to be, well, we have some green. Um, so that's this stuff for one. Um, mm -hmm. so far, so close and yet so far. Um, <laughs> Um, hmm. I could put this here, then this here. Okay. Like, that's already fairly decent, but not good enough, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Maybe that super success rate does something, but I don't think it does. Mm, but it's already an improvement, in my opinion, mm, over not having it. <coughs> Later on, you will I will be able to get things and make them better and then make the things better, but the things that are made better, it's all about that. Ooh. She made a fishing pole. All right, and look at Sophie being supportive of her past, uh, of her wife's future self, past self, past self, of Plata. Okay, fishing rod. You know it's a good game if it has fishing in it. Um so reel and fish. Approach a fishing pot point and press X. Fishing is always a matter of luck, but the weather condition may affect what catches are available. And that's where the mechanic in this game, which is changing the weather, comes in. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. So Plachta is gonna be the one who does the the other things. Hmm. And hmm, let's see. Can she do them already, or do we need to have something else first? Um, device recipe. Ah, okay. We do have to have something else first. But what we can do is make some of these early things. Hmm. <laughs> To get her some levels. Mm -hmm. I am not at the stage yet where I can make the chains to get the super traits. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at her being cute, but also very tense. Mm -hmm. Very adorable. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, see, she looks a little bit happier with the result. Mm -hmm. And she got a level up. And that's what we're here for. Um, this really streamlines the process. Process. 
Um, and this whole thing is a little bit more chill for me when we don't have some kind of thing on the horizon. When it's like when a game's like uh, there's some urgent thing and then you have some recipe that takes days. I don't know, it just gets my anxiety. It is how it is, I guess. Um, um da -da -da -da. Which of these are cheap things? Mm, to think natural oil, to consider natural oil as cheap. Kind of funny. Because in previous games, that was something you could only buy. In limited quality quantities. Mm -hmm. And look at her. Even happy of the result. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, there could absolutely be really good things here that I'm wasting. But I think that's fine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, exactly. <gasps> Not very happy. But don't worry, honey. It's just honey. Didn't even plan that one. Um. Mm -hmm. Uh, same thing here. Mm -hmm. I mean, for like extra info. These games tend to start with a cauldron exploding. <laughs> Not in this one, sure, because we are pretty experienced. And you know what else? I have a website now. CrimsonEve.gay. I made some pretty cool tutorials. Something with gradients. Super fun. And chat display. That's just simple how to get the one in with stream elements. Uh, some HTML, CSS, just basically a crash course in how to get some HTML, CSS file combination going. Um, it has clips, presentation, like basic social. The thing that such a website for a streamer should have. Uh, my next plan is to take the 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 stream elements chat display and kind of hack it to have more more complicated, more fancy display variants. Cause you can do that, I think. Got to figure it out. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And it really annoyed me that it was so hard to find like anything on how to get chat on your screen which i'm sure a lot of streamers in the early days will have this similar experience unless they have a friend who already streamed anyway this is not a good item <laughs> but it's fine uh that reaction is also cute. Um, I have no idea which of these things are like rare. Mm -hmm. The other thing that I'm planning to do, as I probably said before in some place, is to make a Twitch bot that's like has quote database. I think that's fun. And a good exercise for, you know, database and probably PHP too. Since that's what I'm currently learning. 
Um, and that was quite a mixture of a lot of different things. <laughs> uh, um, jumping back and forth between talking about the video game and talking about the ion things. Uh, that calls for one thing, and that is some water. <sighs> I was I was find it funny this kind of these faces VTubers make when they drink water. Like that was kind of loud. Sorry about that. About that schmutzing. <laughs> okay, again, not very good, but fine. Nonetheless, uh, let's take the cheap stuff first. <clears throat> Our girl here is not gonna like it, but that's fine. Mm hmm. We can always use those at, as filler themselves. <laughs> it's not a failure, so it's fine. Um, <laughs> um, same thing here. Um, I have not even looked on what I put in. I just kind of took the bottom of the line uh quality skill power let's go for burns Q as well um i am also gonna try and make some okay next thing i'm gonna do equipment so she has these these hands that she fires on things pretty fun Pretty fun. Um, so we need yellow and red to certain amounts. Mm -hmm. Um, this seems good. Um, pretty much equal amounts of stuff. Um. I don't need green. Mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah, this actually seems the greatest here. Okay, let us see. Um, we can put red like this. And then then unfortunately we cannot quite get the thing I would want here because I prefer the link there. Ah, oh, this is this okay. This is kind of annoying because um maybe like this. No, like I want to have both of these and have them connect. Hmm. Maybe like this? And I want to also get the points. Uh, too bad. That didn't make a difference. Um, <laughs> Blue is actually not used anywhere. <laughs> I think I don't actually have to use it anymore. But I'm still gonna. Okay. Da, 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 da. Interesting. Never watched that anime. Mm -hmm. Um, put that here. Then we can put that here. And 
and put it here, combine them. Seems pretty good. I have no idea what BT is. But it looks good. Okay. Um, we can also make these boots. I think we should definitely make them. Um, here we need some green. Um, and it's that we have a lot of yellow. Um, this is a good one. Um, yeah, that looks good enough. Um, put that here. Uh, you want a lot of green. Uh, wait, those, those things weren't green stuff. Um, oh, we get the full sturdy XL. I approve. Um, that can probably be overwritten since it's not actually useful anymore. Um, hmm. uh, let's combine them to get a thing. Actually, we're almost... Looks pretty good, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That is also a pretty good thing. We oh a critical finish nice and she got level up um so I think with that we it doesn't actually take that much that much time in game to make things um. So that seems good. And so does this. Nice. Okay. Which is nice because they both attack twice now. Um. I do believe there was at least in Sophie 1 a mechanic where Sleeping gave you friend points, and I kind of interpret that as everyone is glad when you finally sleep and don't don't work through the entire night. Um. Okay, we made some things. We got some stuff. Let's go through town. It might be a good idea to look at the things we're supposed to be making. Um, we can give in that craft, for sure. Mm -hmm. um, da -da -da. And I think before I'm going on with the, with the main quest, we're gonna try and tackle those big ones. We might be a little bit underpowered. But we have some more equipment, so... Mm. Mm. I will always be pro-slacking, though. Da-da-da-da. Mm. <laughs> he is very relatable. Mm. 
and be all a little bit lazy sometimes. I mean, same and mood. <laughs> uh, mm. uh, mm. Fucking mood. Mm -hmm. I mean, I mean, extremely relatable. I really like that one. I'm going to make a clip out of that. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, the infrared is active. As it's supposed to be. Right, I was I was doing a thing. Cause we made a thing. Uh -huh. we can actually give in a lot of stuff, huh? Um da, 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 da. Like a lot of things. Mm -hmm. I like it. Mm -hmm. da, 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 da. Um, very nice. Um, we have pure water. I think we got that. Quality over 100. I think I'm gonna take that mostly because that's a good thing to work towards. Um. Mm. Oh, I have way too many, huh? Oh, wait. I done it the wrong way around. <laughs> These were things I could report in immediately which is nice i have a lot of things still to do uh i was wondering hey when did i take these and the answer is i didn't um okay i said i wanted to tackle these monsters but i'm assuming we don't have to go far to get the uh, the recipe idea very likely just the same thing we did with Sophie and that is well you just go to the place and then then you get an idea or rather Plachta will get an idea <laughs> but after that we're gonna try and see whether we can tackle these specific ones um okay you wanted to go there we can also start trying fish uh for which we have to actually equip the thing mm hmm um, and that should be a cutscene. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, I guess the one who got the idea is in this case, Sophie.
Um, let's try fishing. Okay. Didn't have to do like any kind of specific thing. But we got some fish stuff. Got some pretty shells. And that's the fishing spot. Um, I'm just gonna go back to the atelier for now. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm, yeah, pretty much. So, lots of different things to unlock them. Like, sometimes you have to fight some enemies. Sometimes you have to craft the thing and then you get a, an inspiration for the next thing. Or you have to make an item of a specific thing of it and suddenly get the idea to make this other thing. Hmm. Can't forget to take breaks. Hmm. Yeah, eat some stuff. You can't do these things on an empty stomach. Mm -hmm. mm. Uh, it's nice that she immediately recognizes the, the little details of her wife. <sighs> huh. Very interesting. <laughs> okay. So she got an idea, huh? <laughs> um so how good of a thing can we make this? Which is likely gonna mean how little do we have to go back and recharge? Um we could use some green in there. But that's about it. I guess we didn't even need that. But ice level one. I'll take it. Um, let's get this here. This here. Um, I'm gonna put this here. Yeah, that sounds good. And then I can put these here and finish the lines. We got a good amount of uses from it. No. You can also just choose not to put stuff on. There are conditions where use minus one might be useful. I would have to look into it. I guess we just did the crafting immediately. Which makes sense since we are in town. Oh yeah, the combat is also quite interesting. How they did that in this game. Which obviously we will see once we tackle these enemies. Mm hmm. Da -da. Um, <laughs> exactly, Olias. Mm. So, yes, you see, they are also pretty boys. Mm 
<laughs> so that is also a plachta that is very early in alchemy. <laughs> Since for context, basically, and mm, you know what? No. Maybe I just replay Pl uh, Sophie 2 at some point. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you watch Sophie 2, watch me play Sophie 2, do you care about being spoiled? Hmm. Anyway, our Plachter, before she got turned in, into a book and then a doll, was a pretty high level alchemist. Like, extremely powerful level alchemist to say the the minimum amount mm. Mm -hmm. i hear remiziel is also hot <laughs> which is weird because i'm pretty sure remiziel is the past version of sophie's already dad in the main game grandma so, I mean, it's not weird for us to say that she's hard, but for her, it would be. Anyway. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's not. I don't... Like, I guess you can tell your, like, family, hey, you you look good. You too. And all that. Anyway. Lots of good looking people. Mm -hmm. So this time he's with us. Mm -hmm. Well, that makes sense. Yeah, the, these games are all about lots of characters. Great. Um, and more cutscene. Hmm. Hmm. Sorry. Hmm. Oh yeah, that's a kind of bomb. Mm. <laughs> I mean, if you bake cookies, is that a form of alchemy? <laughs> And is it better to bake the cookies regularly or with alchemy? I'm pretty sure they eat cookies regularly in the game normally. So it's not a one-to-one -one replacement. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, can you bake? <clears throat> I mean, I buy stuff from you. <laughs> yeah, you know what? That is a good way of looking at it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> you turn a couple ingredients into another thing. So yeah. I 
and to quote questionable content. Baking is science for hungry people. <laughs> well, shit. <laughs> Um, a Cisco. Ooh. That's a new mechanic. Assist skills can boost item quality, modify the synthesis panel. Mm. That's a good point. I'm going to take a quick break soon anyway. So... You know what? Perfect point to take a break. Because <laughs> I need to do stuff. So, gonna be back in a sec. And you have some food in you. Okay, and we're back. <laughs> so, boost item quality, modify a synthesis panel, and supply additional materials. Hmm. <laughs> uh. Ooh. Um. Form enough links of the associated element. So it's more of the link stuff. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, friendship. Mm. Ooh. So, more friends give you more stuff. Friendship. Oh, finally, a tutorial on friendship. Uh, progressing through the personal story. Mm -hmm. That's great, since I always loved speaking of the people, getting stuff, and just get a gun. <laughs> Suddenly, hunting rifle. <laughs> uh, Mm. 
So naturally, that's the thing we need to do. Hunting rifle time. Um. So it needs yellow and white. The yellow stuff is probably still one of the good ones. Oh, we can get some additional attack. That's useful. In fact, we can get even more additional attack. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, like that seems reasonable. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We don't get any of the wind bonuses, obviously. Since there's no wind stuff here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, putting this here. Uh, like I think this can be considered a g pretty good success. Um. Also, we definitely got an overboard of the of the yellow, which I think is still pretty decent for a first item. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um. Mm -hmm. So let's see. Uh. We want to give you the new weapon. Mm -hmm. Um. Mm -hmm. So that also likely means we should regularly speak with people. I think. I think. Um, let's go through town, speak with people a little bit, and then move on and get, try our hands at these, these super enemies. Mm, then you can show off a little bit of the combat. Um, <laughs> so does the game still show you where certain people are? Maybe, but I think it only shows you events. Mm. Like this one. Oh, if there are events. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's probably the most reasonable way of building so. Mm, to be fair, this is still a pretty good way of building. Mm. Made of woods and everything. Mm. <laughs> Wait, I can make you arpons? We weapons. I mean, yeah, yeah. In prior games, you would actually go to a blacksmith. In other games, you'd made them in the cauldron. You also made a boot in the cauldron, but only kinda. With that, you actually had to do it in a little bit different way. Like in fear in other year fears, you did make a boat of alchemy, but oh, component wise, not the whole thing, not a whole ass boat thing out of the small ass thingy. And there was some extra mechanic 
with a huge furnace thing where you made stuff with. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, lol. Did it even show up in my, uh, held by automod things because it doesn't show in here like not at all <laughs> no automod tends to be a little bit weird uh Well, I'm not going to worry about it too much because, well, like there wasn't even a message for me to approve, which usually there would be. Mm. Uh, you know what? Sometimes it's just weird. Uh, now I wonder what other words are in there that I don't actually want to fill out. Because like in another stream today, we had problems with the word big lesbian. Like, not just the word lesbian. And like the streamer's name is Little Big Lesbian, so you know... That would not be one that should be filtered. <laughs> uh, Automod is weird sometimes. And I don't understand it. Obviously, I'm going to probably keep it the way it is, because... Eh. But might look into that later. Hmm... <laughs> Mm -hmm. I mean it back to the game. It makes sense uh so pa -pa -pa. it would make sense that the game wasn't that the, the place wasn't changed that much. Cause well it looks pretty ide idyllic. And if you look to some old buildings, they also didn't change. The reason they ch the when buildings change tends to be because of war. And like, um, obviously, when they built a new, because there's just not that much reason to completely turn the... Like, except if you're one of those weirdos who take a really beautiful house and turn it into this, this white, colorless, function, futureless abomination. Uh, sad it is. So yeah, makes sense that it still looks. It looks like some kind of German town. Honestly. Hmm. Hmm. Um, let's, I want to have a look at these settings, if they're like this. Um... Mm. Da, 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 da. Mm. They just have filtering. Mm. 
The weird thing is that these will just not show up at all. Hmm. Who knows? Hmm. Yeah, that, that one's weird. Definitely. It might be just its own weirdness. And again, the weird thing is that it didn't show up in the court messages. <sighs> um, let's get on with the story, Vanna. Um, <laughs> so I don't particularly think I need to buy some stuff right now like they could be but I don't have a particular thing I want to buy so we want to fight some of the big ones. Um, ooh, more recipes. And here you can see how you get these ideas. Like you grab stuff, you give her things. Ah, dang it. I forgot to do the sneak attack. Because then you could see the the effect. The kind of things this game introduces. Because you basically have a back row and a front row. So... This time I got a point for attacking in this mode. And now I can... Now you, the, can these people can basically attack as a team. Which is really nice because it reduces the price of skills by 10. Yeah, by 10. Which means some of them are just free. And free is good. Definitely overkill here because they were not a big problem. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Um, and that's also a thing we're supposed to do. And here's that other thing. The special gathering points. So it's time for some gambling. Um, which I'm not necessarily that good at. That's kind of an interesting mechanic where you can get bonuses on the things you gather there. But depending on your equipment. <laughs> Gambling, I'm in. Also, to be fair, it's barely gambling, in my opinion. Like it's a it's a gambling like mechanic. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh, got some mud. Um I always have the urge to probably give us too much here. Even though I would actually have a goal here, which is to find one of the big guys and try our hands at them. Um, but first we're gonna fish. 
Because that's the thing I couldn't do before. And now I can. Um, might as well fish again. Mm -hmm. Looks okay. Not the best stuff, but certainly not the worst. Um... I will generally grab these gathering spots because they're just good. Um, I'm not really looking for anything specific. So it's a mixture of things, I guess. I guess that's the most likely outcome. Okay, let's see where we can tackle that big one. That is why we're here. Mm, didn't get the hit in. Um, resistance to that one. Um... <laughs> um we can try that one um I don't have items equipped apparently that's not very smart um Double impact is an area. Hmm. Let's put on some resistance. Since this is a big one, we do need to put on some proper stuff. Um. Anything not resistance here? Um. Mm. Uh, decrease the target. Mm. Why don't we do one of those? Um, and maybe some poison. Seems like a good opening, most. Hmm. Mm, oh, you hit kind of hard. Um, we're so good on MP. Um, let's try a hand on this. Or this. Well, it does a good amount of damage. Um, none of these are perfect. But we can reduce its its attack, which should be good. Mm. Um, do be blocking, which makes things significantly easier. Um, you can just attack since you do it twice. That should be useful for sure. Oh, that itself takes up a thing, huh? Um... I guess we can try this one. We're doing pretty good. Mm -hmm. Time to do some simple attacks. And maybe finish it up with some special stuff. Um, actually, we can just f straight up finish it. Okay, very good, very good. Um, 
Okay. Get level ups all around. That was pretty good. Um, and then then I guess we're gonna go forward well forward kinda but we're also gonna grab a lot of things on the way I do sometimes have the urge to go through this fast, but that tends to mean that you're missing out a lot. Um. Oh, so close to the all. Um. Did we not? Oh, we have a fishing pole. Unfortunately, no bug catching yet. Mm -hmm. Um, the items we get here are still pretty normal. But I'm still gonna get them. Mm, empty 100. Apparently we get a lot of items here. That's pretty useful. Uh, so if we hit them directly, we can directly use the stuff. Which is very nice. Um, I mean, these are easy enemies, so we obliterate them anyway. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I'm not saying no to things and items and stuff. Um, mm -hmm. uh, no, can't do anything there. Um, I probably need one of these. So let's grab those two. Can't hurt for that matter. Um. Mm. Thank you for the hard work, little bees, indeed. Um. <laughs> This is definitely the kind of stuff that I think is a good idea to do a little bit off screen. Because you don't have to do this all of that on screen. Huh. <sighs> and immediately get more stuff. Uh merely get the the good stuff going um it's a little bit of a pain when you don't attack don't defeat them in the first one because then it's just kind of wasted but of course it doesn't really matter that much in these early stages mm hmm Um, I can grab some more things and then we're gonna go to the next area. Obviously, more gambling. Um, okay, there's no all this time. Well, sure, money. Mm -hmm -hmm. Um,. I do want some of these flowers. Do I have no idea 
which things I need more of. Which I get, guess I could look up, but we have so much space left. <laughs> Definitely lots of space left. Um, can see the thing we need yet. Um, I think I'm just gonna concentrate on the the special stuff. And we have an all. So close. Would have been nice. If I understand the word all correctly here at least. Uh oh that's more bees. Uh more bugs. Not bees, but bugs. Um Fishing, which also is just a button press. Even if you would maybe expect that to mean that you actually do fishing. As in you have a prompt that you get to click on all that kind of stuff. Hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um we need to fight specific enemies still. And I wonder where they are. Mm. Um, so I'm gonna concentrate on that. Okay, that's a special gathering point for bugs. Um, the nice thing is this time around the game actually tells us which things we have. Uh, which things, which are the things that we're looking for? Um, what's that, that star with the colors? Hmm. Um... There's this area which probably has some stuff on it. And there should there is likely some kind of thing as well. Um I do need to fight some of these, so let's do that. Um <laughs> Da, 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 da. Which is definitely taking one out immediately. Um, and then I can take the other one out with the twin actions. Because we took one out, we get another another point there. I'm um, TP, TP, it's TP. We get more toilet paper. Um Okay, we gotta find some fight some more of them. Well, we gotta find some more of them and then fight some more of them. Um that is stuff we don't have a lot of. Um what is this sign? Okay, because it's raining we can't rest here, I think. I think. 
Um, there's no quest to fight these thingies, so... I will not be tackling that one. And I'm not gonna tackle the other one either. <gasps> it's a shortcut. Cool. Um, okay. Apparently, this is a thing we needed to get stuff. To get. Um... Which means we likely want quantity. Yes. Very good. Um, so that's something we need. Let's sort this by quality. And just throw away some of the... Okay, that's definitely not how I would have done it. Very good. And we have a chest, which is not very good. And I'm not gonna grab it. Which apparently I can anyway. Um Okay, I don't think there's any real reason to not immediately bring this stuff back. But that's what I'm gonna do. Lots of recipes unlocked. And I think oh we have still have some things to find fight here. Uh in the breezy field. Um so some one of the boss monster monster is supposed to be somewhere here. Um but they might be in one of the other areas where we, I think, can't get to. Um, I wonder where these things are to change the, the sun stuff to make it rain. Well, we're just going to go here. There's some things here anyway. I'm assuming a bunch of the things we will only get once we change the the weather in the other area, like other enemies and that kind of stuff. That makes a lot of sense to me at least. Mm, I have seen these things in the first area, but I don't know where. That's probably a thing I need to do on my own, just while gathering and stuff. And white neutralizer. That's good stuff. Um. Mm -hmm. Let's see. There looks to be some special enemy or some special version of these mushrooms. So let's tackle that one. Um hmm, 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 hmm. We should be able to chain chain this pretty effectively. Just like that. Um I think that's a really fun mechanic. So I'm enjoying that part a lot. Uh, oh, there's probably then also stuff with using some of the other skills. Since this, as it was shown, was a thing where we use these specific things and got something out of it. Mm. It's always nice when you kind of just get these without even trying. Um. Sure. 
more stuff. Having like a lots of things on there, I think is quite good. Um, later we should be able to get even better stuff. When we have better equipment. Which in turn is very nice. I'm looking forward to that. And that's how you know I like this game. It's like, oh, we can get more stuff. And that is something to be excited about. And I do think it is something to be excited about. Um... Uh, let's go back. No, I don't actually want to go back right now. If that isn't even is something to go back to like that. Ooh. White neutralizer. I thought we already had that. Might be white neutralizer for Plachta. Okay. And we got the sun leg. That's nice. Mm. Ooh, that's quite a difference. Fascinating. Since this is, in case you didn't know, basically a dream world. Mm, where people can fulfill their dreams, literally. In a very bene benevolent way, because the you have to be here until you fulfill your dreams could be interpreted as a lot of ways. But here it's benevolent. Oops, sorry. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. <laughs> of course, so we like that explanation. Hmm. Hmm. It did go all shmoom and boom. Was that no that's not what i wanted uh wait uh schwum or schwum and wham yeah schwum and wham i would describe it like that uh weather control tools no i will not skip it mm, um yes yes mm. Okay. Um. Mm, yeah, that's as as expected. And pretty cool a mechanic. Mm -hmm -hmm. 
like that middle area that we've gone through, that little island is likely not going to be accessible. Now. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Very cool mechanic, in my opinion. Like, we got all this stuff down there now. Um, still got water in there, which makes sense. Um, is there anything immediately visible that's different? Hmm. Let's actually explore this. Because as you can see on the minimap, there are now some creatures there that we were looking for. I don't know what they are, but we were looking for them. So let's tackle them. Why don't we? Mm. And that's something new. Mm. Not gonna say no to money. Ooh, nectar fruit. I like it. Oh, yeah. These. What are these dryads? The little cheerleaders. Um, okay, none of them are resisted, resistant, resist, none of them resist the things we put upon them. Um, I think, oh, huh, this is vulnerable, but there's really no reason for us to use our MP for this kind of low level mobs. Besides, they stand no chance. Obviously. Okay. Um, and that's hunting riots. Let's do that again, because why not? Da 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 Okay. Excellent. Um let's see what else there is. Now, does it change what kind of items you find, too? Okay, so there should be access to one of those chests. Likely no access to that... that middle path. We can't just jump down there, but we can go down these stairs. And we also gather white sand here. Yeah? So that's not a gathering point. Hmm. This looks like a big gathering point. And it's a hammer. Makes sense. That you would use a hammer for this. New things. Uh, very interesting. Lots of things for us to use. Um, sedimentary soil, which makes sense, because that is a riverbed. Wait. I hope I haven't shown my dumbassery by not remembering what... What does, is that again? Sedimentary soil? <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna leave these as is. 
distance, we have things to explore here, new enemies to fight. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, no TP now. But we can just attack, since we have those, do those double attacks. Um... How effective is it to shoot a uh, sunflower? Also, they look cute. Hmm. Da 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 da. -da. And for now, this whole thing seems to work pretty well. Which makes fighting his little moods not only easy but very enjoyable. Because obviously it's fast if you use skills, but then you're kind of like, ah, oh, I better if I use skills. I'm gonna have to, you know, actually use my MP and heal down. Well, unless you don't you know, do the thing. Hmm. Oh, that was so cute. She high-fived her weapons. Adorable. And that's a quest. Um... There are special gathering points. Um, well, it's something. Okay, good stuff. And cutscene time. What is that thing? Interesting. Do we get a talk with Remiziel then? Who tells us not to go through there? Or to tells us to go through there? Or we go through there and that way meet with Remy Ziel. Hmm. Agreed on the danger. Hmm. Very high. Hmm. See? Sophie agrees with me. Mm. I mean, I also really want to go exploring. Uh. Mm. <laughs> uh. She does want those monies. <sighs> and she has gone in. Well, that certainly moves the plot forward. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, obviously, we're gonna follow. In fact, every. Like, we are Sophie, so in fact, we are already in there. Well, we play as Sophie. Mm. 
Mm. And as you can see, we are inside of there now. Ooh. Mm. Oh, that's super interesting. Mm. Oh, that's definitely a highlight. Mm. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess that's kind of a a tear in the fabric of this dream world. Mm, connecting different parts of it. Mm, and it rains again. In here. Obviously it would still be sunny in the other area. And I love how these, like the the costumes change again when you in when it's raining. Mm. Also, if you look look closely to the faces, you will see some drops of water flowing down. Sometimes. Don't know how frequent that is and with whom it is and with whom it isn't. And of course it's it's a texture. Which is an effective way of doing it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm I also think we should be go keep going. Oh, she definitely would have. Hmm. I mean, she probably has. Like, that's where it leads us. Hmm. Hmm. And there it is. You see these droplets? It's cool. Hmm. Just these little touches. She might have just settled down at that point. Mm -hmm. Um, mysterious ruins. Uh, oh. Ah, they're not affected by day. Uh, interesting. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Um, but I'm gonna take a quick break.
Time for the things that you need to do. So gonna be back in a bit. You make the weirdest faces when you not in view. <laughs> uh. da -da. Okay, let's go. Let's explore this place. Mm. We got ghost. We got jellyfish. Hmm. Okay, we didn't get the jump on them. Um, uh, I guess we got a good all well, the big stuff. <clears throat> da -da. Oh my god, I get I'm getting a little bit weird on the voice. <clears throat> Are we only gonna go you know, for another half hour or something? Um. <laughs> yeah, that's more like it. Um, I'm gonna go with the one that don't have to use stuff. Way good. Also got new things. Ooh, the first ring. Mm, those things are going to be especially useful once we have some other things. Like more traits and then the the all bonus traits. Which give you a huge boost. Especially in the early game. And I'm still have that thing on. That's of course not what I want. Um... Uh, <clears throat> Mm. Oh, definitely have to turn off the rain here. I agree. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let's go. And that's more weather. Um, we got some ancient pillars, which seem to be renewable 
on account of it being a dream world. Um, Silver Web. Um, we get some flying things. Let's take them on. Mm, not like this. Um, mm -hmm. So first we gotta whittle them down a bit. And then we can probably in the next step use the twin actions. Um, yeah, exactly like that. Um, don't quite have the vulnerabilities here, but it doesn't matter. Hmm, as you can see. And these are just moops, so. Mm, moth cloth. That's good. And of course, lots of new things. Crimson grass. Of course, I like it. Of course, I like crimson grass. That's only natural. Hmm. Um, the crimson itself is more of a light color. What's depicted there looks more like a crimson red. Um, ah, a little bit finicky there. Um, There looks to be some things that you can only do when it's raining and the water is high. Mm, Sylvia? Sylvalia? Very useful. Um, Let's go up. Ah. Might as well change it back. Um, because as you can see, we cannot go over there right now. And we have lots of uses on our thingies. So now, yes, that's exactly as, as I expected it to be. Mm -hmm. oh, I love this mechanic. Um, wait, where are we exactly? Uh, there is more stuff. And we're full, actually. Um... Uh, that probably makes it a good opportunity to return. And then we can just go back here normally. Uh... <clears throat> so it's interesting that we're basically now seeing that Sophie taught Plachter a lot of things. If we assume some kind of stable time loop. Interesting. Giving us a little bit more insight on the process of alchemy. Even just these little details. Let's flesh it out a bit more. Mm. 
Hm. Ha. Kiet. Okay. A very old tome, huh? Oh, I'm intrigued. Huh. I guess it's surprising, but maybe not that much. Mm -hmm. You gotta do what you get with the gotta use what you have. That's that's the words. Mm -hmm. da -da -da. <laughs> You just gotta accept that you have a very smart wife. Mm, Ooh. Exciting. Nope. Don't care about what I have done now. Ooh, so many things. I will not be making any of them here. And instead, we uh, look, we're just gonna go to the town normally. I think that's not a bad idea, a bad way of doing it because that's just a little bit chill, more chill than just clicking on a button and immediately getting us where we want to be. Mm. Mm. We might even get some more stuff from people. Do I'm expecting we don't. But I like the kind of roleplay idea of Sophie going through town and talking with people. Mm. Probably not a lot that changed here. Yeah? Um. Wait, I have seen that pony somewhere. Um, not a hundred percent sure where. Hmm. Got a lot of things done. Um, sure, let's get this. Try and get this one as well. And we have shells on mass, so that's not a problem either. Mm, okay, nice. Um. It's very late, huh? In the game. Ooh. What exactly did she make notes on them? Um. So something in Pika's Emporium. And the residential district. Mm -hmm. 
So let's meet up with Pika. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I ship it. Mm hmm. I ship it. <laughs> also, look at Pirka. She has this this three mouth. I love it. Da da. Mm -hmm. da 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 Ooh, that's not good. Mm -hmm. Good on you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Agreed. And that's one of the things. Like these 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 cutscenes, as you can see, they give you an insight that these people have lives outside of the main character, which in so many like epic games you don't have. And that alone makes these worlds so much more lively, so much more vibrant. <coughs> I love it. But I'm seem to have throat issues. Anyway. Oof. Ha. Huh. Hmm. Don't know what that is. <laughs> That's very cute. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I definitely ship it. Mm -hmm. Yay, that was a cute scene. Um, oh, we have so many, so much money. Um, sim quality plus seven. What does that mean? Uh, ah, that's good. Charm and Duft. Um, we can splurge a little. At least a little. Um, mostly because we have so much money. Um, That's what you get for doing things fairly diligently. Um. Ooh, and we got some recipe ideas from it too. So it paid off. Um. Um. So there's more here. So we got a thing with Olias. I'd prefer to in the future be able to just know where these are. But right now it's was a little bit faster. I guess I should just need to go south. South. Mm. Mm. Huh. 
<laughs> that seems to be the way from like the the gossip from the townspeople mm. they might just also have the hearts for you <laughs> Uh. <laughs> mm. Not in the pretty boy voice, huh? Mm, you gotta be a little bit more of a hunk than a twink, though, as a bodyguard. Mm. It does seem that way. Mm. Yay. What things? I freaking love all these mechanics. Uh, mm. Um, anything else? Um, let's use it as an opportunity to go back by ourselves on foot. Because I like to have a better. Better understanding of the area. That definitely helps in immersing yourself and not like breathing through it. Because it might be faster, but it's kind of robbing you of some of the experience. There's an upper floor. Hmm. Hmm. That's interesting. That's actually a positive for him. Mm. 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 But he might also just be pretending. Which, to be fair, hey, why not? Oh, guess what? I was a king in the real world. Oh, yeah, sure. In your dreams. Wait, isn't that the opposite? Like, it's not king in his dreams? Anyway. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cute. Mm -hmm. Is she busy or is she taking a break? Mm. Look at that tummy window. That costume design is genius. Mm hmm. <laughs> yeah, that look she sounds like that kind of person. Mm. Okay. Um let's finish some of these things. Um sure, let's go from here and see what we can do the things. Um 
Okay, so the thing we need to grab is visible. Or the the puny we need to fight is visible. Um. Hmm. Uh, let's get the good gathering spots. Hmm. More quality. I'll take it. And there's the biggie. Yay, we got the bonus stuff. Um, let's just start with the good things. Um, uh, da -da -da. okay, let's start with the stuff that's obviously what we need to do attack down very good um since we're probably gonna almost go back after that um okay your skills aren't very really useful here um that's resisted but some of them still work uh that's certainly useful, reducing its accuracy, hoping that it will miss. Um, okay, that didn't really help. Um, but we're pretty good in terms of health. Um, we're doing a double attack, absolutely. Um, attack degree seems like a good choice. Um, yeah, this sounds good. Um, um again, resistance. Um, so bullet spray it is. Whittling that thing down slowly but surely. Um, doesn't really help. Ooh, that did hit kind of hard. Um, let's do that resistance disease that resist uh, decrease. That seems like a good choice. Um, again, that attack is resisted. So... Yeah, light laser. Not very good, honestly. Um, apparently I don't have any items equipped. Let's put some of that resistance on us. Um, and then save on some resources by using this stuff. Um, and combine it with some more of the good stuff. Mm. Mm hmm. Okay. Yikes. That was hard. That was some hard attack, huh? Um. Ooh, what do we have available? And how much does this one still have? So much. Hmm. Hmm. We might have to get out of here because one of us is already down. Um, no, I think we're going to be fine, but it's... Uh, 
definitely a problem. Well, you're gonna switch. So we don't have anyone in the back line. That's uh, definitely a problem. Um, and you are almost out of MP. Not a lot of damage there. Um, let's get some basic attacks in. Oh, still, it's very hard. Um, we don't get any twin actions, which is unfortunate. Um, let's put on some resistance. Um, hmm, you do still have some things going, but this, this is not going to do it. Um, it's not perfect, but it's going to do it. Ooh, doing quite a lot of attack, huh? Okay, we might be out of stuff. No. I'm gonna get the frick out of here. Hmm. Yeah, that didn't go quite as well. Um. I'm gonna try and change the weather here, and then I'm just gonna give us some resources. And slowly bring the stream to an end. Especially if it's then been a good more three hours. I think that's pretty good. Hmm. Hmm. Da -da -da. Oh, that's a different kind of thing here. Hmm, interesting. Um, I think we kind of have to go back since we're very low on stuff. Um, hmm. We do did learn pure water, and that's good. Okay, let's go back here and explore this area. That is very much... That is very much something we want to do. Um, Let's just focus on gathering things and not fighting stuff. And hopefully at some point we can start some of the chains to get the really good stuff. Mm -hmm. Um, okay. We need it to be sunny. Step number one. Um... There were a couple more things here that we... Oh, great. Look off. <laughs> that we didn't get to. So that's also something I want to look into. Mm hmm. Okay, so that's a chest. Love me a good chest. No pun intended and no innuendo intended. Um, whoa, a thousand coal. Very generous with the money, which I do appreciate.
There's also stuff here. An inner area we haven't been to. Mm. Ooh, we got stuff from those, huh? Puny candy. Mm -hmm. And that looks pretty good. Mm. Mm. This looks like a different thing that we ha don't have the item for. Ooh, kupfer ore. Ooh, little secret area. Or kind of secret area. You gotta be fishing. Okay. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got crabs. I like it. Um, so what else do we have here? We have some kind of thing that we don't know the meaning of yet. Which is almost definitely something we will learn when we actually meet with Ramiziel. Maybe. I mean, could be. I'm just gonna straight up assume that's the case. That makes a lot of sense, at least. Mm -hmm. And let's see. What else? I think for the rest of this day, I'm just gonna explore the rest of the area until we're full. Um, and that's gonna be how I finish this thing off. Gushing here and there about the game. As you do. As you do. Ignoring enemies because I'm not really in the mood to fight them right now. Um, not where really I need to. Oh. Mm. We are seeing these yellow ones a lot, and I'm assuming that's um. Storm? What makes sense? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, they're kind of basic, but not bad. Wait. Empty 45 still? How much space do I have? That's kind of weird. I mean, I'm not complaining much. Uh, some kind of door. Hmm. 
I wonder what else a thing where you combine both effects. Because the tutorial tells us that sun removes all weather, weather effects. Hmm. Mm. And there's a thingy again. Mm -hmm. Um. Mm -hmm. So, might be was checking these things. Um, I wonder, could we just straight up finish the assignment for this thing, the, the quest? Because mm. we might, and that's certainly a good end for the stream as well. Um, so let's focus on that. And then I am getting hungry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, new material. Always good. Oh. Okay, we are at the end of... The lion. Um. Well, in that case, let's just go and see to the end of the quest part. Um. Um. Which mm, might not be here. Mm -hmm. No, it would have definitely been the other way with being... Wait, no. We've been going on... Oh, I, I see. I see. I think I know where we were supposed to go. Again, our coffers are full, but we can still get to the end of this quest line easily. Possibly, maybe. It would certainly be a good thing, I think. Yeah. Mm hmm. 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 And I don't think the game expected us to change the river into sunny here. And I'm right, because we had to have these be all up at the... For this to be... For this to work. Um... And... Then we can change the weather again, which we need to do. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um and then we should be able to continue from there. Mm -hmm. Also, the game is simply gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Um, this is newer than Riser, I believe. 
than Riser 2. It's definitely newer than Riser 1. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we got a checkpoint. Um, you know what? Since we have that checkpoint, we can just quickly get back to the the atelier. And then we have full covers again. Mm hmm. Which is very good. Um. <laughs> and then we can go here. And we should just start right at this point. Um. Um. Now let's look. How fast is it gonna be to get to where the game wants us to be? Because I'm not gonna do too much more. Um, you know what? That is actually already the the answer to this. We have unlocked the checkpoint. I need to take a break, eat something, all that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna call it here. I mean, it's a bonus stream anyway, which I'm probably gonna repeat until, well, none of this game. <laughs> so let's go to the end screen. Um. So that was fun. Now a fun game. I'm gonna be back tomorrow with more inside it. Definitely gonna play through that over the course of the week. Uh, that's 6 p.m. GMT plus one. And yeah, that's it. Again, go check out my website. I love it. Uh, and that's gonna be it for today. So thank you all for coming. See you next time and goodbye. Goodbye.